Hey guys, uh, Leif here from iTech. Today I'm going to show you how you can access the Konica Minolta MFD panel remotely. So what you need to do is to copy this uh, specific URL that I've got here. Uh, this is uh, needs to be HTTPS colon slash slash and then the IP address of the printer, in my case, 192.168.2.38. You need to look up the uh, IP address uh, first and remember that, type that in here. Then you've got colon 50443, which is the port number. And then you have to type this in exactly as it is here, slash panel slash remote underscore panel dot CGI. And if you do that, you might, uh, in the first instance, get this message that you cannot reach this page, which means that the MFD has not yet been configured to accept uh, or allow uh, remote access. So what you need to do first, if that's the case, go to the web page of the printer, which I've already got up here in my window. So that's just uh, uh, web browse the printer. You want to then log into I'm just going to show you this. You want to log into uh, the admin section of the printer. So to do that, uh, when you first access the, the web page, you'll see that it's you're logged in as public, but you want to go log out in the top right to log off. We then want to go to administrator access. Put in the password. The admin password, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in my case. And go login. Uh, you can then search for the function you need to modify. If I type in remote in my search bar, we want to go to the remote panel server settings. And we want to turn that on. And again, you can see that uh, the port number to access is there. We then want to hit OK to save that setting. And we want to log out. I can now go back to my other tab, which is this uh, URL we need here. If I refresh that, you get this page. This site is not secure. You can go to the web page. And I have now full access to the user panel of your Konica Minolta uh, BISUB MFD.